I published a game, an ongoing game, like a month ago to Play Store so people can download it for free. Of course, it's a free game. And uh, give me feedbacks to develop the game even further, to fix bugs, to fix everything, to create the best looking Android game possible out there. And um, here's the results after a month. Right now I have um, 829 active devices which is incredible because all the downloads I had was uh, nearly 6,000. It's different in my cell phone, it's nearly 7,000, I know why it's showing this number here. But anyway, it's between this number and 7,000, let's put it that way. Uh, my Android vitals are not good at all. I have a lot of people that, I mean, if you pay close attention to my rating, to the average rating, it's not good and there's a definitely, there's a reason for it and that, that reason is because of the performance of the game. So the game, as you can see, is a high quality, high end game where to play it you definitely need to have at least a medium end hardware to run it smoothly and uh, be able to play the game to enjoy it, but there are a lot of people that try to download the game, their cell phones are like really, really weak. I mean, so weak that they, they're they having a hard time running their own operating system. They're so weak. Like, I'm talking about the cell phones that have 2 gigabytes of RAM or something. So these cell phones are not made to play games with <laughs> let me <laughs> put it simply for you but anyway so these people definitely encounter crashes encounter um, performance issues a lot of performance issues laggings so I just uh, come up with this brilliant solution that I have to uh, monitor the, their frames per second their FPS so the, if the FPS is less than 15 I have to go ahead and reduce the graphics quality for them so they don't really encounter a lot of performance issues this is just because I want my games rating to be higher I don't want people to experience such bad performances and most of those people don't even know what graphics quality is they can't really they can't just enter the pause menu and change a graphics quality themselves because there's a settings for it that they can change so if we go into the ratings, and I don't, I, I don't really know why, but some people can't play the game. That's so weird. The game is based on ES 3.2. If the game is not compatible with their, with their devices, they can't even download the game. But they are downloading the game, and they can't play the game. This is something I have never faced before. That's so weird. And some people don't just. This guy. <laughs> gave me a one star review and he just wrote criticism what what does it mean and some people is he's just games not good enough just give me some details this game is in active development i have to fix things i have to fix a lot of things i have to add a lot of things the best possible outcome for this is if you have a criticism for this just give it to me give me a feedback so i can use that feedback and Add something valuable to the game or if you have a suggestion if you think that the game is not good enough and the game can have a lot of those features that you have in your mind just give me those features those suggestions so I can just go ahead and implement those suggestions this is like the best possible outcome that I can foresee for everyone so like this guy he told me that the games got some issues the character's face is just stuck to the ground he helped me fix it uh, I could eventually fix it as you can see I have a lot of history with this guy I could eventually fix it and he changed the score to four he uh, I guess he initially gave me a one if I, if I remember correctly but right now he gave me a four and he's waiting for a pad support in the future and he'll change it afterwards I guess or I don't know but he's helping me he's giving me feedbacks he'll, he's helping me to develop the game even further and that's that's what's worth in this section right and the game wasn't really optimized I mean I thought it was but I had a lot of transparency issues a lot of 
transparent layers on top of each other so the rendering time would be a lot and the devices would be really really hot and uh, the controls would be unresponsive just because the device is super hot and it can't really um, process everything at the same time. I'm not using CPU a lot because I know that mobile devices don't have really powerful CPUs but I'm overusing GPU and I know that I'm pretty aware of that and that's because I'm using a lot of fog, a lot of effects, a lot of particle effects are in this scene and a lot of um, I mean all the shaders, all the effects, everything's based on GPU in this game so I'm overusing it and with lowering the uh, graphics quality you lower the load on GPU so that if you're having a real really bad experience I mean right now it's just automated so if you're having less than 15 uh, FPS the game's quality will be lower until it just hits the floor and it can't go any lower but that's an option you have and uh, I guess it's it's pretty magical it works just super cool and a lot of people that are like uh, collisions are not working controls are slippery and non-responsive or very poorly optimized these people can eventually play the game in a better state because I got rid of a lot of um, transparency issues now the GPU load is a lot less than before and um, the automation I had implemented just helps a lot in every way you can even imagine um, so all I'm saying is that the game's in active development and it is going to be even better every day and uh, with every update I'm adding a lot of uh, new customization stuff I'm adding a lot of new animations I'm adding a lot of new power moves that you can so there's a if you come in here in the uh, there's a rural area so we have the jungle here it's, just, it's called rusty jungle and then we have the rural area so I created this woman over here so you can come in here and uh, buy clothes with the the money is called rust box in this game so with the money you accumulate in the game you can come in here and uh, buy clothes I will have to add a lot of other characters so one of them will be selling you new power moves so you can use those power moves to get rid of the players faster one of them will be selling you soldiers to help you out in the game uh, and probably one of, one of them will be selling you, I don't know, new enemies and then we have what we will have if you paid attention there are doors in the, uh, in the map there are three doors that are leading to another maps so those maps are other maps that will be created in these areas and for unlocking those maps you'll have to pay with the uh, money you accumulate in the game so you have to play the game you have to uh, go further in the story mode you, you will earn a lot of money you can double them by doing some things like some power moves some different currencies that you again can buy in the rural area and then with all of this together you can come in here and uh, buy new maps which I will add to the game it's it's gonna take some time I mean it's just a month into the uh, game being published so we have a lot of time and with with the feedback of you all it will be a much greater game I believe uh, but new maps will be added the story will be going forward story is complete in this map at the moment I don't intend to uh, continue it even further because we, ha we will have a lot of maps and the story will have to be shown in those maps so the story won't be like stated in the text anymore in other maps we will be having a lot of cinematics a lot of dialogues a lot of people that you have to interact with uh, the text based story is only uh, specifically for this map not any other map uh, and that's the whole thing the game's in active development and it's going super super well I believe the performance is getting better with every update I'm getting a lot of more uh, more downloads uh, 
people are starting to I believe support the game even more and that's a good thing and people are starting to like the game and that's awesome um, just go ahead and download the game for free and give me feedbacks and I wish you a great time playing the game thank you